If you're with your family, your class to need See the mission that I'm on, you can't compete Who came before me or after me I repeat Yo, have uh, friend. What's good, my guy? What's my good? Uh, good evening, TMR. <laughs> I respect. Apologies for the lateness, but apologies. You know the time over here is the clock's gone back, and it's all a bit of a madness right now. I got that update because I co I got a couple brothers there, Slim Buck and Silver Blinks, and apparently I think it's some sort of daylight savings time thing y'all got going about there and um apparently your time has you an hour behind so now yes 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 but if he had the time the clock went back again again so the time yeah so the time right now here is now just 10 p.m what's the time over there now 11 okay this is 10 58 p.m <laughs> right okay well at least we know there's just an hour between us so then the event obviously itself will be at 9 p.m your time yeah, straight up. <laughs> right, right. But welcome to the TMR podcast. Anyway, my brother, appreciate having you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. It, let the people know where you're from. Okay, this is um the Big Bad Wolf Alpha Hybrid representing West Africa. Um, Nigeria mostly. But yeah, let's say West Africa. <laughs> That's okay. So have you ever been to um like any like overseas? Have you been to UK before, US before? Uh, no, 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 no. The only travels I've made are just within the continent. I haven't been outside. Right. Of right, right. Okay, okay. So if you don't mind me asking, what is it like then in Nigeria? Okay, Um. I mean, I'm going to just be a diplomat about it and just say, okay, it's all good and all that. Uh, yeah, but I mean, if you study the situation around me, then you should know it's not supposed to be like this. But right. I would say... I mean, if you're one of the, the lucky people to actually find your feet and, um, you know, get right. things going, yeah, you might just enjoy Nigeria, but <laughs> it's, it's just the, I mean, just like it, as it is almost every other place, but right, just, uh, right. but yeah, Nigeria is Nigeria and you right. know, we live in. Nah, right, nah, salute. And yeah, like I come across the Nigeria battle rap scene this year, you get me? And it's just right. like the scene over in China as well. They have that scene, Sharon battled over there as well. And yeah, oh, it's just good to see that I there's different. I don't think it was China. I think, was it the Philippines? Somewhere like that. Yeah, Asia, somewhere in Asia there, right? Correct. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, yeah. So yeah, so it was good to see that there's different scenes, you get me, different countries where there's battle rap happening. But yeah, in Africa, it's definitely shocked me to see how big of there is of a battle rap scene, you know what I mean, in in Nigeria, you know what I mean? So man was happy. So how did you even start battle rapping? Okay, um, you know, just for respect for the culture, I won't just start with my story. So I'm going right. to start with them as a whole see battle rap in africa or let's still we're focusing on nigeria has been going down for a very very long time we're right. talking way before 2010 right. okay way before, and at the time there wasn't like particularly an established platform to you know consistently push out every battle rap slash rap battle content that these guys were working on okay so right. just knew that okay we just knew that um okay, there's a rap battle event going on. Let's just run through. We didn't get any information prior that it was going to be happening now. It was just right. more like a impromptu, okay, yeah, we got this thing going down. So we're talking late, uh, not late 20s, um, to 10s, like um, from, let me just say from 2010 upwards, we started getting some leagues come up. Right. Some leagues, um, then we started getting uh, characters like, um, to, I'm talking the first era, I'm talking... um. Holy Field, Dabu the Gemini, Queen Mother, Jay Pacino, Cav Banks, mm. Spike, So those were the cats that actually brought like battle rap. Before they were just rap battles, but now okay, we say okay, it's battle rap because it's a totally different template. Look at it, right. like, okay, rap battle, but with battle rap, there's a, there, like a whole level of technicality and all of that. So um, from their class emerged other classes, and. Um, yeah, there were some who were still text battling at the time. Some were doing text right. battles. You know, there's some others would be right in their home, just like where I'm standing. Right. Rap, rap, just like what your guys got in. TMI yes, podcast. yes, correct. Yes. But, but 
small scale. You get what I mean? Right. So like, so up until um, like past 2015. Right. Or, no, no, no. Past 2010. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to get the. I don't mistake. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We started getting hardcore um, battle rap content. Okay. Battle rap content coming from different leagues. Right. Uh, Oz Rap League, Rap League, and um, yes, then more leagues came out of that. Right. Yeah. Basically, I don't want to like take too much time, but yeah, it's okay. Go ahead, bro. Take your time, bro. Yeah, a movement, a very, very long movement in Nigeria mm-hmm. for a very. And I would say it wasn't up until last year we started getting that international recognition. We're talking over a decade of work, over right. a decade. From people who, I mean, some stopped. We wish they continued to work with us. Uh, but, you know, some still kept on pushing, motivating us new cats um, to like, okay, yo, uh, we, we started this and we, we see you pushing that work, you know, pushing that work further. So, right. yeah, you keep on doing that. I mean, why we keep, um, you know, motivating you. Then, um, yeah, I'm one of them, the new cats. Okay. But I wouldn't say particularly new because I started Battle Rap live on stage. 2022 March okay. 2020 that was my so, so before the stage was you doing then the text battles and stuff like that yeah I was doing okay. even WhatsApp like um video battles like this. okay and 2020 um 2020 no 2020 now not 2021 2020 um, I had my very first video battle courtesy of battle rap Nigeria right yeah I uh, had two video battles then um I had one 2021. Then from my performance in those um, pl- um, video battles, I mm. was given the battle live on stage. So right. I'm, it's just been up from there. You get what right. I mean? Right. You did this one. We like it. Um, still rusty, but we see potential. Keep on going. Oh, the second one was fire. Keep on going. And then before you know it, you know how the game goes. You stay long, you stay long in the game enough. You start to craft your own storyline. And then right. you have people having opinions and like, okay, yeah, um, this is, you, you know how it is. You, you, you yes. just buy yourself in the game. And then people have a lot to say about you on stage and even behind the stage. So right. yeah, that's how it's been. For me. Right. So talk to me then a bit more about the text battles, because that's something I've never heard before. The text oh, battles, not even the video text. So how did that work? Okay. Um, first off, for those, um, this is the very first platform I will be saying this. In the text platform, I didn't go by Alpha Hybrid, funny enough. Okay. Yeah, I went by a name Samurai, and this was way back 2013. Right. Now, uh, we utilized Facebook. Facebook was where they like they had a whole lot of groups. Good. And then, okay. You know, mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Let's get this going. You drop your bars, and then that is where you get to um, assess. You know, that is where I, I think text battling is where you get thorough um, review of your mm. right. because on stage you could just you could just you could go with your slant. You, you could go with a little bit of slanting with your multisyllables. Right. But when it comes to text. No, you cannot. They are digging into everything. If you go in multis, we're like, okay, they go and tell you this part of the rhyme sequence does not connect. We ain't doing right. that. So that 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 takes away some points. Right. So the reason platforms where um, in Nigeria we had this um platform to Naira Land. Yeah, we right. had a couple champions there as well. Um, you three, the demigod Slimbuck. I'm sure you've heard of Slimbuck. Yeah, yeah, Slimbuck. Yeah, yeah. I, I was at the event last week. She salute to Prem and then. Yeah. Had with rapper. Yeah, I just saw that on Twitter. Great work mm-hmm. you're doing, Yeah, so, no, I appreciate that. Yeah, you three and Slimbuck started from Naira Land. Uh, okay, they had some work in Naira Land. I can't particularly speak to them starting there, right. but I know they work in Naira Land. They grew to prominence in Naira Land and a whole couple of other cats. Some we right. wish was of us, you know, in the game, but you know how life goes. Yes. 20 friends, 20 years. But I mean, they're watching. They're watching and uh, mm-hmm. yeah, hope they get back on track. But yeah, you three and Slimbuck right there in Naira Land. And then, uh, you know, they moved on to um, WhatsApp Battles. That's where we had a uh, Battle Rap Nigeria slash What on the Streets Rap League. Right. Yeah. And, you know, from there, uh, we also got uh, a couple other text battles. I think a couple other um, OGs we have. I think Queen Mother also did something like um, a text mm-hmm. battle. And um, not sure so about 
So, so, so with the text battle, was you writing, say if me and you are battling now in the text and round one's on me, was I writing line for line or was I just copy and pasting my whole round in the oh, group? Copy and pasting. Okay, let me just break it down to you. Right. <clears throat> Let's say Alpha Hybrid versus um, TMR, yeah? Right. Mm -hmm. We can set up today. We are to drop our bars tomorrow. Okay, so we got to write today. Okay. There's a a deadline let's say okay we've got someone we've got to submit those verses to so let's say adam 4 p.m tomorrow you need to have those bars submitted to this person mm -hmm. so when that has both verses they post it out there immediately mm -hmm. so you can just read then the judges mm -hmm. can evaluate oh, that's lit that's lit still like different i never but, heard of that before yeah it's not on the moment it's not like at the moment mm -hmm. you have to go there's some people who took three text battles in a day wow three text battles i think you three was one of them three text battles in a day you just have was, to it, write was it three rounders and one or was it just one rounders usually usually one rounders right 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 and it's decisive like okay yeah uh you just want you only got one shot at this drop that verse we don't go and check it so whatever angle i mean you ain't nothing like rebuttals there because you don't right. know what's coming. You don't know what's coming. So, right. Um, no, right. So, okay. So then how did you then get into battle? Like you start battling yourself. What inspired you to pick up a pen? Okay. Um, I've always been in love with rap, rap okay. music. Music, yeah. Yeah, I, I feel like um for me, you know, I, I listen to my idols rap, man. I listen to um the Eminem, the Drakes, the Wayne, the right. Benny the special and um i'm like okay this is it but there's got to be more to it there's got to be a way that i can you know make it more than just entertaining right i can make art form for attack so right. i watched a couple movies too about rap battles and that even got me like more hyped then right. I across uh, a battle that is um holy field versus black bones that was the very first rap battle or battle rap content i ever came across this before right ever the url the kotds the i battles and the likes then i was watching yeah. it and i was raving like oh my god i want to do that like right. i want to do it. Right. at the at the time i didn't even know they had to prep for it i thought it was all freestyle like okay yeah yeah, yeah. they had to like go write their verses like okay mm -hmm. i mean this was a 2019 2020 right. I, I started to do my investigation and this is where I discovered that there is actually a battle rap community in Nigeria. Right, but right. I have to get close. I have to get close. So I started talking to one or two people. Oh, yo, I'm a big fan of the arts. Um, like, how do I get to join in? And all oh, that. Right. Yeah, I mm -hmm. remember hitting up. Um, yeah, I, um, yeah, before... Okay, the, the, the closest, like the, the very first point of entry I got into battle rap was when I hit up... Um, Jung Majin, that's the CEO for World on the Streets. Okay. I remember the, yeah, I remember uh when he when I texted him like, yo, can I be a part of the group? The question he asked me was, um, are you sure you're ever going to rap though? Mm -hmm. <laughs> They're always very selective who they bring in on the group. Right. But right. like I mean, I want to. Mm -hmm. So let's 2020. I get my first um my first two video battles, 2021, another video battle. I said the 2022 just been up there. How far hybrid became a name, and mm. yeah, everybody been getting it since then. Mm. Okay, so how 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 was your first battle? How did you find it? Your first on stage battle, especially. How did you find that? My it was breathtaking. Mm. <laughs> I mean, you're standing in a room where not um, not just strangers, but people you used to watch. Like back home battle. Right, right. I used to watch U3, used to watch Slim Buck, Queen Mother, G Zone, Gaddafi, and almost everybody on that card. Yeah. Salute to Queen Mother. I I've I've seen I heard her battle in the spaces. Yeah, she fire. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember walking to the um venue that day. It wasn't even about my bars. It was more like, oh man, I used to watch you like I mean, yo, it's just funny, like it's dope seeing you. Mm -hmm. It's an honor honestly you, you know me just like getting to meet these people taking selfies making conversations then when it was time for business we're like okay 
it's it's usually different on stage because the whole crowd goes silent. Now it's about what you what you got to offer now. Let us hear right. what you. And if it's mm -hmm. not dope, it's just do it or you don't. Mm -hmm. And two extremes to it. No no compromise. No compromise. Only two extremes. You right. do it. You don't. You fade in the shadows or you step into the limelight. So mm -hmm. that that how it is and thankfully i mean i lost my mind man this is where preparation plays because a lot of ballers may not know this but some of us go into autopilot when we're on stage right. that is rehearsals from behind start mm -hmm. to kick in at that point it's not like what you're saying it's not your mouth telling your brain it's your brain telling your mouth because no. you've been going through mm -hmm. and shit right. so i got done with my performance and everybody was wowed now mm -hmm. what motivation for me to go on but as i mentioned earlier it was some so sort of rusty but i mean it was, it, was your, well, it was it was your first time on stage it wasn't it so that that's understandable but then that's the next question i was going to ask you what was the feedback like after your first battle yo um okay the feedback um i'm a, i'm a, i'm a drop a weird secret right now um slim Buck, if you're watching the so very, sing back. So sing back. very first voice note of you telling me I had a very fire performance is still with me. I still go back to listen to that shit because if I was able to wow someone like Slim Buck, then I know that, okay, yes, I really did something good. Then mm -hmm. a couple other voice notes, like that is when I knew. I didn't think I did well enough, but these people are like, yo, that was fire, man. That right. was fire. And we got to see more of you. We got to see more of you. Like, I mean, there are times where I'm like, okay, maybe I'm not doing enough. Then I just play that voice note. Then I go to that performance. I'm like, yo, I ha I'm doing enough. <laughs> mm -hmm. I just have to like, mm -hmm. again. Yeah, I have positive feedback all through, more than what I anticipated, more than what yeah. I expected. And that's what has kept me going up until now. Yeah, and that's Lynn. I salute to Slim, but yeah, he's definitely special. I, I got to, I had the privilege of seeing him for the first time that weekend just gone, right? And yeah, he battled Eunice and especially the first round like i i give it uh eunice two one second and third but may that first round from slim but was legendary it was legendary legendary yeah first round was groundbreaking was, yeah round. legendary very aggressive i well, you, you saw it already yeah on the patreon i i only got to see the first and second round the third round i haven't checked it but okay I know it is very clear that um the first round slim buck second yeah. round that is yeah. what I can yeah, 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 yeah. And the third was Eunice as well, but the first I'm, some slim, but say this, I'm gonna check that out tonight. Yeah. I've been I'm nah, facts, but the but slim bucks first, a legendary, and especially man was in the building with it. You get me, and he was aggressive yeah. and pushing up on Eunice and everything, you know. What I mean, yeah. yeah, it was like that. That is slim buck. I have had the honor of um hosting one of Slim Buck's battle, that was um Slim Buck versus U3. Right. Now, that was my that was okay. I I watched Slimbog go versus um Queen Mother. I also watched um okay. The second time I watched Slimbog perform was versus U three, and I tell you this, Slimbog has got a unique type of energy, man. Mm -hmm. When he starts to walk, the whole room changes. Yeah. If you if you just go check out Slimbog versus U three, I before he, what where, the moment he started his round, I had just had to go like, okay, it's about to go down. Let's get mm -hmm. this going. And, and the thing is, and the thing is about Slim Buck, right? It's my first time meeting him, right? But when I met him, remember obviously the day that he's battling and he was sitting on, on a bench, right? And salute mm -hmm. to Craig G. Me and Craig G went over to him and I met him for the first time. And he, he came across quiet. He came across quiet, right? And even Craig G said, Oh well, man, salute, man's gonna let you do your thing, they want to disturb you, da, da, da. but he just came across quiet and we even asked about like if he was nervous and he said good nerves but and he come uh, it just looked like he like he just looked like very shy quiet and then Eunice obviously went first right and yeah. obviously Eunice had all the energy that's what I'm saying and obviously I'm only seeing slim but like meaning to be quiet mate when mm -hmm. he when he was his turn nah that was I said a whole different slim but mate a whole different slim but I think I think I mean it just boils down to the personality of um the battle rapper. Yes. Mm -hmm. You don't know what a battle rapper is capable of until they say I said it yo or they just mm -hmm. start. I, mean, nice. I know a couple, know a couple battle rappers. You meet them in person, like 
this man will not hurt a fly. Mm -hmm. Then, he, like, that is a Tasmanian devil right devil. there. That, <laughs> what what i hope i hope how it translate how his first round translated in the room i hope and pray it translate that on camera too because it was so electrifying and whatnot i just hope yeah. and pray it does it that's a legendary round it is it, it, it is it's a round that for me is a round that i feel like is going to be played back in years to come it will be that is slim buck <laughs> that is slim buck our boy Trust me. yeah and, and and um you know for those who i mean the african community some part of the african community is not even they're not particularly worried about you know the outcome of that battle they're right. just happy that africa's got some limelight in battle rap now yes yes as i mentioned earlier it's been a lot of work put in to push this culture where it is now yeah. so much for 2022 or the years before then but i would say uh international recognition for nigerians in battle rap started from last year mm -hmm. then it just expanded it just expanded like i had um, a space battle um on okay. i battle right on i i'm um, very first uh, like oh, not my very first i had them um, on otr then okay. um I battle i'm still going to be having some more then um i also have my, my brother boys the boy wonder and um you know a couple of others you know being scouted by these international platforms like oh yo we got we got someone there also and he's killing shit bring him over like bring him right. over bring him. so we're just hoping that all these efforts of ours translates to you know an actual life performance over there yes yeah, we yes don't mind doing the space battles we don't mind so long as you know africa still has that spotlight that okay yes we, um there are battle rappers here a lot of them uh, we've got slim buck who's also like you know um beamed that light on africa yes. mm -hmm. the world is now focused on africa and nigeria and it's not just nigeria we've got uh ghana as well lyrical right. Wars. Right. lyrical war yeah um i kid uh, the man who battled um slim buck before um he battled um black t no, right. no south uh, um, mk Southside. Mm -hmm. um came to ghana last year battled there as well and right. we've also asked Appearances in Ghana from Chance the rapper, so it's basically been a good year for right. uh, you know the Arab community in Africa. We're getting but, that, yes. mm -hmm. and it up is going. It's just going up for us. Right, right. So who who who's the name of your first battle that you had on the stage? Who, who what was his name? Ah, uh, Nick L. Angelo. Nick L. Angelo. Okay, yeah, we, okay. We so how, how so 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 did did you win that battle? Uh, I, I don't even know. I, I To be honest with you, and it's not mm -hmm. a matter of, okay, anything, anything. I just know that battle happened and nobody talked about who won or who lost. Right, right, right. I'm with you. I'm with you now. Mm -hmm. but, uh, it was more of, oh my God, this was fire, this was fire. Because right. mm -hmm. he came correct, I came correct. So I didn't particularly get any feedback as to who won and who lost. Right, so right. So... Uh, Okay, so then who who was your second battle? King Arbix. Okay, okay. So how did that go for you? How did that go? Yeah, um, second, uh, okay, as my debut was um, a one round battle. Uh, okay. Long as, uh, my second battle was uh, yeah, King Arbix three rounds battle, fire one. I was even more. I was more electric than my first um, battle. So uh, you know, right. I mean, it's an okay. Now we let you off for the first time. Now mm -hmm. you have to, like, okay, convince us right. that uh, this stage is your home as well. Mm -hmm. So it was, yeah, man. Um, buzz about so that was um, uh, that was that that was a uh, uh, at a time when you know the new era for battle rap was starting to emerge because right. my um we we like uh, my class of battle rap had like three battle rappers, me, King Garbix, and Joe Vegas. We we're like the three of our class in battle rap from like from our era but there right. have been other after us but like for us so um that battle really did a lot um mm -hmm. you know in both our brands out there we had right. a couple reactions the boozy gs and a couple others just you know getting in tuned with us but we still hadn't gotten that you know international international hype if you get what i mean right so, right right yeah so right. that was just yeah so okay so how many battles in have you had, like, just on stage only? How many battles have you had? 
Okay, I recently had my seventh mm. life battle. Okay. Yeah, so Michelangelo, second, King Arbix, third, Joe Vegas, fourth, Godson, mm. fifth, Toby the Pen Priest, sixth, Simeon, then seventh was my recent one, Master P. So yeah, that's um seventh live battle within the space of um three years. Okay, so is that one on YouTube? The latest oh, one. The Joe Vegas. I see C C Minon. Yes, yeah, okay, For everyone watching now, now if you go to my Twitter, um, it's my pin Twitter. I've got a playlist. Right. Yeah. The only battle you will not find there is um my battle versus Joe Vegas because sadly um there were technical issues that um, right. the league thought it best you know to preserve its um. Uh, re reputation for de bringing out uh, for releasing quality tapes, yeah, because the audio was messed up, it really, right. really momentum. So, rather than actually putting it out there and making people wonder why would you release it in the first place if we cannot enjoy it, they just mm -hmm. are like, then yeah, that that that's just as by far as the story goes. Well, I mean, right. we'll see, um, if that will be happening again. Right, so I have I have the playlist here. Which which one did you say was the latest battle? Okay, that one is to be released next week, Master. Okay, so it is Simon that is the had to go. That 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 yeah, I performed that battle. This recent one, my was um two weeks ago. I had that okay. battle too. So right. they uh they, they they want to do something different with it. Mm -hmm. They're gonna be that in theaters. Okay, right, yeah. right. Premiering November 9th um, uh, in Lagos, yeah, in premiering in theaters. Then, in right theaters, after, that's lit. Yeah, after that, you get to see it on YouTube. But, like, after, you know, they yeah. want to connect to those outside that do that those not on YouTube right. that um, not know of battle rap. You know, you put it in theaters, they're like, it oh, is, okay. yeah, people, yeah, you can go see it, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, that's just one initiative. Um, this thing so that that's just that about so you will just only find um i think five live battles okay yeah because of technical issues and um the master p because it is yet to be released but um from november 9th to like let's say two weeks after that it most definitely is going to be out there right okay well what we like to do here on the tmr podcast we're gonna do a thing named the bar breakdown all right so we're gonna okay. play we're going to play the battle with you and Simeon, right? Just okay. your round. You just your round. And obviously, we break it down. So if there's any bars that you would like to obviously break down, or if there's anything I hear, then obviously, just let me know, stop, or I'll pause it. And then obviously, okay. I'll see what you meant. You know what I mean? So you can break it down. Let's have it. All right. Give me one sec. Right. Damn. Let me know. Can you hear it? Yeah. Shout out to Simeon! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me grab. Round two is on Alpha IB. Let's go. Oh. Round one! Yeah, it's round one. I'll say, yo. Hey, yo, yo. Make sure the quality here. Yeah, there you go. Now the right rap finally gets me, Simeon, on the new stage. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry, let me bring that back. So, battle rap finally gets to see me on the new stage, but scratch that. What's the reason for this, though? Y'all got me battling a nobody who been tweaking on the low. On Battle Rap's bigger stages, my feet is off the show. I even got all the greatest digging on my coat. So I'm going to see Walking, Steve Hawkins. I've been a genius on the road. See this battle rap? Mm. Break down that bar for me, that Steve Hawkins. <laughs> yeah, break down that bar for me. On the road. I've been a genius on the road. Now, the thing is, um, the whole entry, like, Battle Rap gets to see me on a new stage. Uh, for those who know the backstory, um for the most part of my career i was battling on word on the streets so right there i explored a new platform uh which came as a shock to many and um yeah so i mean that was just you know me just sliding in and then the whole genius on the road thing just that's just me you know trying to flex try, you know as a battle rapper I, at that point in my career i was more like okay you know what i'm one of those guys okay you are not mentioning right. the at that point, you're not mentioning the top 10 in Nigeria with my name not coming up. This person, with all due respect, um, I know hasn't really done much in battle rap, but you mm -hmm. know, he has, uh, right now he is the OG, but he still remains the OG because in May, if we, we cannot talk hip hop in Nigeria in general without mentioning his name. You know, battle right. rap is 
culture. But, you know, funneling down, that down to, you know, battle rap, I just had to show him that, okay, you know what? You're in my home base, okay? Now I have to right. show you. So that was just that about that bar. Uh, so no, I'm, I'm fire, 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 fire. Okay. See, this battle, this battle, supposed to get me tested. Is he stepping? I pull up with a mean weapon. If your delivery wrong, it's a baby out with blood. And see, now I'm running up a set. I'm running, no, I'm, the, I'm running up a set. You and your team get it when I'm busting on the tech. Couple dots in those squares and they all fall down. This is the domino effect. All that talk, all that talk about how you going to shoot me. All that talk about how you gonna shoot me? I wish you would try C, but you a wire to light up a Mac. I recognize your type C, my G. Mm, that computer ish, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that cable ish, that type C cable ish, yeah. yeah. So yeah, I mean, you know, one thing about um because as much as we like to appeal to the international crowd as well, uh, we also try to like bring our local crowd on board as well because right. you know here we get a lot of uh we don't hear what you guys are saying and we don't get a lot of your references i mean right. some battle to the nigerian crowd but for some of us who are like focused on um the larger picture which is international collaboration yeah mm -hmm. it's like okay we will cater to this crowd but we also have to remind you that we are trying to take this culture out there so yes yes also, like, be nice enough to, you know, try to understand where we are coming from with our craft. And, right. um, I mean, you don't get it live, you will get it on cam, that's for sure. And right. you know, that will you ride along uh, with these battlers. You get what I right. mean? Yeah, no, facts, facts. Mm -hmm. uh, my G, my G, it's real bars, it's real bars in every line I spit. Wait till they bring your leg when my kind fights in. If I cite this felony, I'm a drive by quick. Get you punished for that offense, and that's fine by me, sharpshooter. It's no misses when my gun spray I bust case. The sharpshooter, it's no misses when my gun spray I bust case. Even let a straight hit you, finna take you the wrong way, gonna be the worst to peel. A lot to spill, lone wolf, when I get support for kills. Per road man to make shit grimy. This is not a drill, you should stay. <laughs> You should have, you should, you should have stayed in your lane. You should have stayed in your lane. But you took the meaner option, talking about you gonna kill Alpha. That's just a mere assumption. All that threat to life fell into deaf ears. Now out comes what the repercussions. You up against, mm. you up against the household name. And yes, a detour in this form is real goal. Press me wrong and the blitz on. I'm known to bomb on niggas. What you think I got C4? Look, bro. Mm. Break down that C4 back. Obviously, his, his name starts with a C. You get me? So break that uh, down. No, the name flipping thing. Um, you know, uh, okay, battle rappers know if you don't have enough angles against someone, you could just, you know, name flipping could be your resolve, you know, to, you know, uh, yeah. getting some around um, or put your opponents. So, yeah, that, that, that was that. Nah, fact, man. It's crazy, crazy. <laughs> he has to come correct. No, you bro. You bro. Look, bro. Yo, Simeon, why you looking tough? Versus Boozy, you was gassed. You wasn't cooking, bro. Now you losing touch. You can't compare to the one named after the letter AC. You just ain't cool enough. This dude get done. Mm. I'm not the G the mess. AC, yeah, cool enough. Yeah, that's crazy. That AC by was fire. One named after the letter AC. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. That was, you know, that was just a slick entry, you know. He uh, was. My, my pattern for that battle was because, you know, um, that crowd is usually moved by haymakers right but yeah but for me i like to the way i like to piece my material is you will not most definitely because i know myself and i've reviewed this over time there are some bars you will not get live on stage right but when you watch it on cam you'll be like oh my god i don't recall this so yes. sometimes I click with my material like put that in then yeah. okay mm -hmm. put that in put something you gonna react to put something slick in put something i know they're gonna react to so right. even because there's also one thing about me if you get a debatable round 
um, versus me on stage, you have to be worried because the cam review might just disappoint you because you you may have just been moved by the haymakers. Mm. You get, but then when we're like, okay, let's now piece into the material via the cam review. Then you find out that oh, okay, it wasn't just about getting the crowd reactions for me. It was just more about being slick with it, drop showing you intellectual superiority, and then trade mm. that into crowd management as well. So yeah. Right. Right, right. Now that's fire, fire. Yeah. You just ain't cool enough. This dude get dumb. I'm not the G to mess with. I studied your style. I mean, I don't let C finish. I'm disrespected. I... You can't. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Break down that. Yeah. That, that C finish bar. Now back to my point of you know catering to the crowd. Right. Now. This is a term we use over here, like it's um disrespect, like you know when you say over familiarity breeds contempt. Now that is um uh um we, we just brought that down to pigeon English as C finish. So right. uh that was me catering to that crowd, then I proceeded to um the crowd who which I want to reach, which is the international right. crowd. International, yeah, yeah. And even like at AC but see I caught that shit, yeah, you get uh -huh. me. I caught that, yeah. yeah. So yeah, yeah, you're definitely doing the right thing, bro. You can't kick it with me. You can't kick it with me. It's really all clear. Triggers gone flat. Your pump fake. Silicon wear. It's a ball game. How you made the list is all weird. Cause they expect you to coach this player, and they got the wrong Simeone. I fire. I fire. I fire. No, no, no. Pay attention to the syllabus. I fire. I fire each mag and attack the clip spray your man's in the field. My shooter, let it kick back and relax. He ain't got a stress for the kill. I got mm. the requisite skill. You dumb wits. He's always simulating your bars when your punches. As a matter of fact, the number of times you say like in this battle proves how much you suck dick. Round one. Oh, round, one. Oh, round one. Round one. Round one. I ain't come here for this bros foley. Quit with your fake angles, nigga. You don't know me. After this battle, your status as OG is gonna mean one thing. What's that? Oh, glory. Oh! Yeah. Uh, yeah, man. Now, now, the thing is, okay, for the record, this battle was like very short time prep for me. In like okay. less, less than a month, we had to do like two minutes per round. Now, mm -hmm. the strategy for this battle was uh, because, as I said, he's more prominent in the mainstream you know hip-hop scene not right, the battle right. now right. there's raps that i try to tackle and you know when you know this is how somebody raps you expect that they're going to bring that same pattern to you yes yes but if you're going to do this this is what you do so like it's just like me trying to be like okay you know what let me just put this there just a little bit of mind games so when he does it it like sort of dampens the impact of whatever he plans to do so that right. was just my to the um uh you know the whole thing and it, it went on for like <laughs> you know for the whole battle i kept you know saying that oh if you if the number of times you say like in this battle okay so, so, yeah so the, yeah okay you say that at the end of each round then yeah at the end of each round so he gets the message so <laughs> if he, he has his materials down he knows damn the first round already you're already doing this <laughs> mm -hmm. so it's all strategy at the end of the day this is battle rap we're talking about nah, facts, it's, facts. This is battle facts. rap. Facts. But we're going the whole go, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Say that again. We're going the whole battle, right? Yeah, yeah. Just just your rounds. Yeah, go through your rounds. Yeah. No problem. No problem. Let's like in this battle proves how much you suck dick. But before I proceed with this round, I'd like to sing a song for the crew. Move this your body, make you shake that thing where you get music and tie your head. That's your project. Okay, yeah. So what now, song is that then? That is his song. Now oh, okay. I, that song came out, I think, 2004. Right. Yeah, so so it's just me saying that okay, you know what? I just because I like to play around on stage a lot. Mm -hmm. So you know, like everyone, I mean, you know this guy. Let's not act like you don't know this guy. So you know what? Let's sing a song, you know, because and yeah, that yeah. is you know, setting the tone, okay, you already know what I'm about to talk about. Right. Like, you might be laughing, but you know, yeah, we are about to address this. Yeah, he's so, taught that, yeah, yeah, break that and, down, yeah. Baraje by Rugged Man featuring Simeon, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, so that was a big tune then, yeah, that was a big song back then, big song. Yeah, it was a song, like, I listened yeah. to that song, you know, when I was little. Little, and, um, mm -hmm. yeah, so mm -hmm. I was surprised when it got me booked versus Simeon, I was like, damn, 
Hip-hop. So le legend where you're from then? Legend. Is a legend where you're from? Yes. Kim Young is a legend. Battle rap yeah. outside of battle rap, I respect him. Yeah. I respect mm -hmm. him where I so, um, everywhere, if you speak about Simeon to me right now, I will tell you he is one of the most hardworking, um, you know, hip hop hip hop artists we've ever had. And right. um, yeah, that's it. He's up there, beautiful mm -hmm. vocal. So yeah, no, yeah, facts, facts. Mm. Okay, okay. You see, Simeon, in this round, is going to be facts you'll be faced with. In contemporary hip hop, you're no match for the favorites. Give no tracks to the playlist. Versus Boozy, you kept talking about his wife. That she was whacking just baseless. Mm -hmm. Crazy how you was dissing another man's marriage, but it was you who was lacking engagements. Damn. Mm -hmm. We're going to talk about it. We're mm -hmm. going to talk. About it. It's the way you set that up, though. Like, the way, just the way you set that up, the flow, the pocket, yeah. the way you set it up. Yeah, international. You get it? Yeah. And your your even your accent is it, it doesn't come across like strong, strong Nigerian yeah, yeah. accent. You get me? No, like I'm, I'm not though. I am Ghanaian, but I just live here. So right, right, I'm right, right. <laughs> the dub makes the Ghanaian and the Nigerian elements combined and also socializing with a couple of other people. I may not have been outside the country, but I have a whole lot of um, yeah, yeah. I say your English is good, Brody. It's stand your standard English, good, Brody. Yeah, like, yeah. So, so yeah, that sort of um, you know um help build my um communication. Mm -hmm. then, then and yeah, that's so, why I'm and that's why we're gonna talk about that sooner. But that's why I'm happy that you'll be stepping into the gulag because I know you're gonna be translatable to the Americans to the UK. You get me for sure. Yeah, for sure. and I see Gemini and. Uh, Danny Myers. Danny, right yeah. Mm. Mm. Of, let's continue with this, man. Let's, mm. let's keep... mm. Yeah. That was crazy. That was crazy. Was like, put that together. That was crazy. Baseless. crazy how you was dissing another man's marriage, but it was you who was lacking engagement. Damn. Oh. Okay, should I bring that back? Yeah. Versus yeah. Boozy, you kept talking about his wife. That she was whacking just baseless. Crazy how you was dissing another man's marriage, but it was you who was lacking yeah, engagement. Damn, bro. You should be part of them BETs, headies, all of that trend talks. But yeah, you are trying to revive your dead stock. If this was on the roof, as planned, I had to throw you off the building to remind you how hard you fell off. It's clear to see. It's clear to see. It's clear to see. It's clear to see that you are nowhere next to me. You've been rapping since I was a kindergarten. Yet your rap stayed elementary. You live in a belated praise. You live in, you live in a belated praise. With no major tapes, they claim to play. I say it's a shame. A nigga called C, but he ain't making waves. It's all facts in my raps. I'm gonna do you a favor. Get this mag in a flash. Since you know blow that yet. Yeah, comes a blast from the past. Yeah, break that one down, huh? The blast yeah, from the so past. Operated a bit of pigeon in there since you know blow that year. That means since, since you know blow that year translates to since you weren't viral that year. Right. So, you know, I translated that into okay, you know, since you know blow that year, here comes a blast from the past. So I uh, just, you know, <laughs> I was finding my way around, uh, you know, because I also had to cater to the crowd. Right, uh, yeah. right. But I mean, it is what it is, man. <laughs> nah, it's fire. Nah, it, it's fire. Nah, it's fire. Solid. Yeah. <laughs> you have to come for this. You have to come for this. You have to come for this. And you're comfortable up there. You're comfortable up there. And if there's any yeah. seven on stage now, you're comfortable. Yeah, I mean, that's at the time. I was pissed off, not gonna lie, but you mm. know, it's just a whole lot going on behind the battle rap scene. Mm. So it's, it's not a story because I wouldn't want to, like, okay, some sort of uh, dodge, like, you know, make things, you know, go mm -hmm. the wrong way. Of course, outcome. of course. So, like, it was a whole lot happening for my battle rap career at the time. So I finally got that plate 
um, I was still pissed, but I said, like, you know, let me make the most of this because, you right. know, battle rappers, we should be able to, like, channel our rage to make something beautiful, which is right. battle rap. Right. That is. No, facts. Facts. It's all, it's all, it's all facts in my raps. I'ma do you a favor, get this mag in a flash. Since you know blow that yet, yeah, comes a blast from I bust a gap, stick on the chop a lumberjack. So cut the crap. Hold up, you wanna scrap? Mm -hmm. This bag I'm in will be the end of your road. See why it's called a sack. Where your goons at? Mm, see why it's called a sack. Right yeah. Where your goons at? I'll be quick to snap at those events, turn this venue to a BAT conference. Clap for no reason, this is my domain. <laughs> Who's those now talking at the back? Hey, what is that? Okay. Okay. Where your goons at? Where your goons at? I'll be quick to snap at those events, turn this venue to a BAT conference. Clap for no reason, this is my domain. You get an outbox if you move sloppy, you don't get the message. This draft, if you make CC and alpha male, do you copy? I must not. I must not. I must not. I must not be who this bros is messing with. Blake, get you crisscrossed and severed quick. You're not popping. All that slick talk irrelevant. So don't come here talking about your past accolades. They know this boy is specialist. Been in and out of countries promoting peace talks and equity. Show passion, growth, and tip top integrity. Even shook hands with world leaders. So fuck is a hip hop celebrity. I am not. Nah. I am not impressed by your presence. I am they not. shook hands with leaders, yeah? From the country, yeah? I mean, no, I mean, way beyond the country, man. For those who know me personally, I work, uh, you know, on projects with UNICEF. And, um, you know, okay. I've also been on you know, conferences with the African Union. So, I right. mean, it's beyond battle rap. Like, right. I mean, don't battle rap, but I could also bring it to battle rap. Right. Because I'm with you. Had, then he would want to talk about how he's um, a celebrity and all yes. that. Yes. So I just had to, like, okay, bring that out with hopes of canceling it. So if he right. has said, he's going to say it, I just have to make it so beautiful in a way that, okay, you know what? He said it, but the way I'm saying mine, Kex sort of cancels all that. So that was right. just the, that. <laughs> nah, sex, sex, sex. Get up. I'm not impressed by your presence, so fuck your high esteem. Y'all thinking I'm a fantasy nigga in your wildest dreams. Yeah. 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 Man, for a fantasy nigga in your wildest dreams. Like, that's crazy. It's the way you put it together, though. Yeah, the chain, the, the, the multi-syllabic chain leading up to that bar. Mm -hmm. That was just it. You know, real talk. Real talk. That's crazy. Real talk. I am not... I am not impressed. I am not impressed by your presence. So fuck your high esteem. Y'all thinking I'm a fantasy? Nigga, in your wildest dream, acting like you the whole savage. Nigga, you are no package. Even your name got a C minus. She just proves you below average. I'm not now you're moving crazy, Alpha. Still. Yeah. <laughs> it's like it's like it's like it's like I'm not it's like I'm realizing I knew you was fire, but it's like just watch it breaking it down with you is that I'm really really now how real fire you are. Like but then, you know the thing is I've got like other fire performances, man. It's just you know we don't really have a lot of time to dig into, but like I've got a whole lot of fire. Nah, but now we got plenty of time. You see, like when that battle drops in two weeks, pull back up again and break it down, bro. What do you mean with okay. there, man? Yeah, you yeah, yeah. So, time with there, man. That battle, yeah, for that battle, yeah, you. And trust me, you will love it. I that battle, Master P came out correct. I mean, I also went came out correct. Mm -hmm. So that right there is battle of the year contender for this year in Africa. Mm -hmm. Not but in Africa. That is how serious that battle is. I mean. Mm -hmm. Like, people get booked versus me, and I get to see a wild, uh, I mean, like, like a wild version of them. So, right. and I wish very, very proud because it just, it just goes to, it just goes to um, say that, yep, they know who they're up against and they do not want to slack off. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. <laughs> nah, That's right, just... right. So, yeah, man. So, so, like I said, anything that you got coming up, anything like that, yeah, man, hit me up. Feel free to pull up. Guys, we know you give me promo from yeah to the end of the year, you know what I'm saying? Promo to the end of the year. So yeah. No, I'm, 
not going to need that promo, okay? My combado coming up um this year, I will be sending to you. We're going to chop it up. Yeah, because, man. Uh, yeah, man. Because um, I'm not um, ju just, you know, just me speaking, you know, as Alpha right now. This year, um, for um, for the first half of this year, I did not know that my battle rap career would be at the spot that it is right now. Right, right from the battle, I started getting calls from international leagues, man. Right. International TMR being one of them. Right. Now, I was on I battle. I was on OG Spaces. Have been on a whole street talk. I like right. this. I recorded my rounds to street talk and I send it to them. So mm -hmm. that's the, like I have had gotten a whole lot of attention from the international crowd and and I do not want to stop. I watch mm -hmm. people like talk. I watch Slim. I watch what Slim Buck did right now and I want to be there. Like, yes, this is yes. I want mm -hmm. to be there. I also want to be, and it's not just me. There are a whole lot of us because right. that rap culture was. Like a lot of people were growing uninterested in the battle rap culture, to be honest, because right. it's one try something for years, it's another thing for you to like not get the results you're looking for. But right. thankfully, Flame Buck is out there and he doesn't know it. But for every battle he does out there, that everyone in the UK is like, Oh, this African is doing well. We in we back in Africa want to keep up with that energy. We want to like yeah. okay. There is more than Slim Buck back in Africa. We've yeah. got that. Uh, we've got Boys. We've got King Arbix, Joe Vegas. We've got Queen mm -hmm. Mother. We've mm -hmm. got a whole lot of people. We've got a whole lot of people down here that you can just bring up and like, bam, straight up. Yeah, bam. yeah, nah, yeah, yeah, man. And that's what I was going to say as well. Definitely any any battlers out there that you know, you get me, tell them, yo, hit up TM, give me my details, boom, 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 you get me, because I'm here trying to help move the culture forward as well, you know what I'm saying? That is there still a slot for the gulag? I mean, this December, uh, uh, there's not now, but next year, <laughs> you already know what it is. Next year, you already know what it is. Yeah, do I've been seeing flyers? What about my fly? Yes, yes, uh, yours is going to be coming not this Sunday, the Sunday after. Okay, because I'm dropping it once a week, yeah, once a week, once a week, yeah, yeah, okay. until until when it's like four, when it's four weeks till the event, then I'm gonna drop the full flyer, you know what I mean? So I'm just Weak announcements, weak announcements, and stuff like but that. See, so die though. Is TK ready to die though? He, he got the respect. Mm, well, well, you see, once we announce it, then you two will be able to then pull up on the platform. You get me? And yeah, okay, okay, okay. I, I'm, yeah. Now I'm ready. Yeah, I'm ready. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. yeah, like I cleared out my schedule this. this. Right. I, my, I am not battling December because TMR got something I really want to you know do something but yo let's no. get back to the yeah i appreciate that though i appreciate that man appreciate oh, that. that was crazy oh, what? i'm rolling with the nine two i'm rolling with the nine two this is stick up shift in a split c y'all see moses in the bible you see it's all love bro but on this stage, erase those thoughts. K go burst the way this cannibalistic. They go think I ate your guts. Mara J mm. was a major hit, bro. Should have given you, she would have given you fame undeniable. But I've got one question. Why the fuck didn't Rugged Man add your name to the title? My nigga, you should call quits. All of your peers either made it or jumped ship. You're trying to be on the same level as MI, but it was your career that was short lived. Round two. Mm. <laughs> that was awesome. Back round two. No, 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 no. Round two. I ain't come here. Hold up. Hold up. Round two. I ain't come here for this bros. Let me go. Round two. I ain't come here for this bros foley. Quit with your fake angles, nigga. You don't know me. After this battle, your status as OG go mean one thing. Yeah, no, that was a fire second round as well. That was crazy. I'm gonna quickly get that third up. Let's get it. Third up. But yo, I'm telling you, the way you put the pen together is different. Like, I know you're going to translate very well over here in the UK and in the US. You're going to translate very well, bro. Check out my other battles too, man, because this year was short time prep, okay? Mm -hmm. Imagine, like, okay, I had to lock in, lock in. Mm -hmm. yeah, so my other battles. This one was short time prep. And shout out to Simeon too for coming correct, because that was also a fire battle. Y'all go tap in. Yeah. That, yeah, yeah Let's keep it. Right. All right, we're getting to the thirds. Oh, I'll find you. Thank 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 you. Th
Finish. You have the classic. Finish your challenge. Uh, 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 give me a classic. Let's Eat that food, nigga. Classic of the year. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. This battle unnecessary to my main plot. When this shit was set up, I was enraged, bro. They could have given me Dabu, Jay Pacino standing in front of me to wage war, but instead y'all got me this fake C. That's worth the J no. This your Lord's oh, 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 Now, okay, for this round, prepare for a lot of um, references that cater to the African crowd for record. Right. Now, Jane Shouts to Jay Noll. He's uh, the big crib in Ghana. Yeah, so shouts to uh, he's he performs mostly on the lyrical walls in Ghana. So okay. you have to check him out. Battled Slim Buck. Yeah, so when Slim Buck battled in Ghana, he went against Jay Noll. So right. yeah, real fire classic, man. If you're talking classics that came out of Ghana, that's going most likely, most likely because Jay Noll also battled Dabu, the Gemini. So you're either thinking Jay Noll versus Dabu. Or Jano versus Slimbox. So that is how massive, um, massive of an impact Jano has to the Ghanaian battle rap culture. So yeah. Right. So that was light straight at him, fake C worth the Jano because yes. he yeah. let's not get into that story. Yeah, 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 yeah. Politics, politics. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> This your Lord speaking. This your Lord speaking. Check my resume. It's only killers that had to talk with me. It's all vivid. That you just a bitch nigga who got bars. That's Bob Risky. See your lines? See your lines? No, no, no. See your lines? Your lines? Your lines don't define. Okay, I bet. I bet, bros. I bet, bros. I bet, bros. I can't shout. See your lines? See, your lines don't define weight. See the difference when you and I speak. Your corny lines could never make you the jagaban of rap. At least we all know why. See, so better resign quick. Oh or the knives in. <laughs> so, so better resign quick. Or the knives in tight grip. Take poke into your core till it drives in. Now it's stuck in between. Siamese, you can get stuck in between. I heard you said Delta boy. Migo, migo. <laughs> well, I never, well, I never cared, brother. Y'all watch me drain this sea. Turn out to sap and what time? Okay, what's the, what did you say there then? What did you say there? Okay, okay now the thing is, uh, it's a Delta thing. Um, Slimbox is a Delta boy too, by the way. So, okay. um, sap water is, um, sap water is a slang used for alcohol. Okay. So, spirits, it's a spirit. So, um, mm -hmm. drain. Water, so it's like I'm making this sea turn to spirits. So may watch, watch me drain this sea, turn mm -hmm. into a. Right. So that was, that was right. just, yeah, yeah, that, that's, just, that is fire. That, that's fire. That you obviously, that, yeah, yeah, that's, that's fire. Like, that is fire. So basically, caters to that crowd, and I don't usually write like that, but you know, based on the platform, yeah, that platform is very, very particular about catering to the crowd. So right. if you check up. Other battles, yeah, you would see that, okay, at that point, it wasn't even about the crowd. It was more like, okay, you know what, um, I'm bringing that international standard to the game. But based on my agreements with that league, of course, I have to come correct on that one. Mm -hmm. um, I'm to the crowd, at least to an extent. Not trying to say, totally change how you rap, but at least do something for the crowd. You get right. what I mean? So right. that was... Uh, no, that was fire. It was fire. That was fire. Thank Thank you. I've got, I've got, I've got the crow, I've got the crow me rich. If you cross the line, the bro deceased. This ratchet really abroad. So when she fly, you know it's overseas, bro, for real. Like, where the fuck were you when hip hop was dying and Afro beats was eating off them talks? A lot of niggas here ain't familiar with your game. I hear it speaking to your stock. When we was gunning for Mount Rushmore, nigga, you was living under a rock. It's, this is an arena for killers. This. This is an arena for killers. You should have known this. This was staring far off could get your nose bleed. Use a single nigga. It could get dark for you if you don't withhold quick. But since you one day call, you're getting co signed with more hits. Yeah. You, see, you, see, yeah. you, you was on a you was on a song with rugged man. You was on a song with rugged man and had no regards for the feature. I had no go and had no regards for the feature on the video. Even rugged man was trying to restrict you. So how you gonna claim Baraje was a work of art? Boy, my nigga, you was never a part of the picture. You see, oh, I look at your walk, walk of art, a part of the picture. You know what I'm saying? The way you just set it up, my boy. Oh, it's all in the setup. Mm -hmm. 
It's the day, just saying. I look at your confidence. I look at your confidence and how you uphold it's not the same. Something's changed for hip hop. You literally invested your soul with all the pain. You went from having so much fire in your eyes to watching your career going up in flames. They told me. Mm-hmm. They... See it there again. See, it's another one of them again. You get me? <laughs> fire in your eyes to your career going up in flames. Watching it going up in flames. All that fire in your eyes just made you <laughs> watch your career going up. In... I was just, you know, uh, you know, <laughs> and I said, but the thing is, fun fact though, fun fact though, that bar wasn't even meant. That bar, I was like, as I said, I was in a bad place at the time. So that bar was actually meant for myself. Right, because, yeah, right. Was on in bad rap at the time, it mm. wasn't going with culture. So. I did a couple. There's one thing I did. It was like a an alpha versus alpha this, yeah? Okay. I wrote a lot of things against myself. So in a way, when an opponent speaks of, I'm like, now nah, I even have something better than that in my notepad. Mm-hmm. So that particular bar was not meant for Simeon. It was meant for me. But right. based on short time prep and it's his relatability to that bar. Yes, I yes. Have- can have the bars yeah throw that in yeah yeah it makes sense it makes sense because obviously he, he a legend he get me and he had that hit you know what i mean so yeah mm. told me in your eyes to watching your career going up in flames they told me they told me to go easy on you they told me to go easy on you, not to overgauge the threat. A senior citizen of hip hop who paid the step, but I'm the type of nigga to kill you just so I can pay respect. They, they be feeding off. They, they, they feeding. They feeding. Wait, wait, sorry, guys, guys, please, 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 guys, please, please. Let me round up. They gas your water down bars, but we both know you like efficiency. You need all that moral support when a nigga about that decency. So better evict the scene. Or before I evict, better evict the scene before I take you to school. I'm talking, get this G check quick. Every syllabus or course of death, then you get quizzed next G. If you get carried over, it's by Paul Bearers. Oh, you don't get that scheme? This was a first degree murder to shut down your BSC. Oh, 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 they should have told this lame G. They should have told this lame G to refrain quick. Why the fuck we even call you C? Nigga, you was never even mainstream. Simeon, Simeon. Simeon, Simeon. Simeon, Simeon. A cool dude who don't respect violence. A humble man with correct talents. This nigga don't even talk much. A lot of times you find this man quiet. So only right I put you down to earth and dead silence round mm. I'm a fucking warhead. It's anarchy in my mental. You asked for an alpha male. A death sentence is what they sent you. So yap all you want. Try to be disrespectful. But you're nothing but history when I'll forget you round mm. Oh, yeah, boy. That's my nigga. Fire. Fire, my boy. Fire. That's just a piece. Mm. A whole lot to what Alpha can do. Mm. That's just... <laughs> but I'm telling you, uh, yeah, I can't wait, Brody. So, yeah, all right. So, yeah, how, how do you feel stepping into the gulag for the first time? Yo, for the record, I am humbled, honored by the opportunity, man. Now, Reason being, I looked at the whole card. I saw Gemini and um, Danny Myers. Right. And like, same card with these people who I watch at home, like just to get my, you know, creativity, my creative juices running and all of that. Right. It's a great, great, like, first of all, thank you so much. Thank you so much for the opportunity. Man, I appreciate I, pre- I appreciate the opportunity of working with you, my brother. Trust me. Representing, you know, Africa for this one, very first edition, you know, very first time an African. This yeah. is the very first yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. This like this is more like the second first time for me because on the I battle space, I was the first African to battle on the I battle space. The gulag, I'm the very first African to do that. Now that is not me tooting my own horn. It's just me thanking God and you know, also thanking you for that opportunity. And just like as I've always said. On my other ones, I will not disappoint. I'm going to make that mark. And people people are going to be more interested in battle rap in Nigeria and also um, Ghana. Nah, facts. Nah, facts. So, all right. So, we know you got TKE as your opponent. 
So yeah, what's your thoughts on TKE? He's dead. No, no, mm. that's his. Mm. The thing is, I'm not usually hyped for battles, but this one I am. Like I'm very, very hyped. I just cannot wait. You know what? If if I really wish he was here, man. I really wish he was here so I could actually like talk with him. You know, shake his pride a bit. But mm. I, but you know, I'm at that point where I am hyped as crazy because I am lucky enough to be to like to witness. Africa transition from the motherland to international platforms and even being a part of it. So TKE, you might be a barrier, all that bullshit, but nah, I'm going to take you down, bro. I am taking you down. Nothing. Ain't nothing you're going to do about it because last time I got this mood, last time I was in this mood, niggas cried. So, I mean, sorry I have to do this, but you just wait. Sorry, man. Mm -hmm. Wait. Mm, well, well, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to that. So, like I said, you guys will be able to link up once we drop the announcement. And yeah, you definitely be able to link up, you know what I'm saying? That's 110 percent fact. Um, okay, so what the, what's the plans for Alpha Hybrid 2025? Do you want to be leaving the country, come to the UK and battle, US and battle? That is the plan, right? That is the plan. I had this conversation with my brother Boaz yesterday. I said, because Slimbox said something early this year before every of this started to happen. That was April on Spaces. He right. said, a very big door is about to open for battle rap in Africa. Right. Door that should that, that bridge, like a door that opens the bridge to international platforms. Right. And he doesn't want anybody to relent. Now we're seeing that manifest. Now mm -hmm. we've just been active on spaces and video battles right now. 2025, I know full investment is going to go into, um, you know, moving Nigerians out of Africa to battle in the UK or in the US. So I know yeah. that is that. I've also got that plan. I got everything, man. Yo, I got my papers. Just right. to yeah, I'm ready. Here. You're ready. Yeah. All me say, yeah, yeah. you know what? Yeah, you're out. You're gone. Yeah. Only thing yeah. I'm gonna get about is visa processing. I mean, I know it's gonna happen through, but everything is set. Everything is set as it should mm -hmm. be. Mm -hmm. Nothing stopping me, man. Just all you just have to do is call me. But yeah, mm -hmm. but then, so unfortunately, it has to be TKE that I will use to convince you. Thank you very mm -hmm. much. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So. Um, what is your thoughts on battle rap in the UK? Whoa, it's 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 quite interesting, by the way. Quite interesting. I love it. Now, <clears throat> for people who are like too familiar with the URL, you know yeah. there is a template. Now, the thing is, battle rap has each battle rapper has his own template. Right. Now, in the UK, it's a totally different template. Mm. You like okay, more than just bars. You also have to like inculcate performance. Mm -hmm. You also have to like performance jokes, bars, beats, um, um, top tier or stupid bars. You just know yeah. you just got to execute it well because right. even down, we we don't do we don't ne always do jokes. We don't always do jokes. It's always kill or be killed. Mm -hmm. But UK scene, you still have to like loosen up a bit, and then uh, you know that actually expands you know broadens your horizon and your perspective with them um, writing for battle rap so you know it's not just about you don't have to bring one method to battling someone you have to like switch between methods you could be playful you could be aggressive you could be serious you could be like unserious taking the whole crowd through series of emotions you get me yeah so that's yeah thing. nah facts that's facts facts so okay so is there is there any battles that you have seen from the UK? Say, yo, yeah, man, would like to battle you if man get the chance. Okay, okay. Um, I got Koj, mm -hmm. Koj, Gemini, mm -hmm. Gemini. I would also like to battle I Kid, I Kid, yeah, Ghanaians, we both Ghanaians, so we better. Mm -hmm. Um, who else? Uh, can I consider Slim Buck <laughs> UK? Yeah, Ghana. yeah, you can. Now you can, you can, bro. You can, yeah. We're gonna talk most definitely, and gas buff. We both need to meet. Right. Let's, let's scuffle, gas buff, my brother. 
I'm sorry. We have to do this. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, I like that. I like that. I like that. I'm definitely going to be clipping them certain bits up anywhere and put that out so they make sure they get, they get to receive that. You get me? Yeah, man. That's what it's about, man. It, shoot your shot, my boy. Shoot your shot. You get me? Shoot your shot. I like. I was watching battle rappers on my phone. I was like, I wanted to do it. I mean, here I am now. Even I... If if I told my if y'all told me that I'm like oh yo you're gonna be one of the top battle rappers in the next two years I'll tell you how did that happen it ain't possible mm -hmm. here we yes. are now so. nah, we yeah. are here we are here now nah, that's a fact my bro and yeah man like I said we're definitely gonna link up within the next few weeks anyway I'm a I'm a I'm a sort something out behind the scenes once we get off here and i might may i might bring that closer to be fair i might yeah like sort something out chain you get me and yeah make that happen all right so let the people know obviously where they can follow you out where they can catch you out and that okay um it's alpha hybrid the big bad wolf on twitter it's alpha hybrid br yeah br for battle rap also on instagram same thing i am very very active on twitter if you tag me on twitter right now you get a response faster than ai trust me so i'm always active there so um twitter instagram follow me there i've got a whole lot of bad rap content and i also run media for bad rap like um as i am known i am the voice of african battle rap if you want media we've got a lot to do shout out to the archive that is um, the platform I, I and a couple of people founded just to document everything in the for battle rap in Africa. So if you want to know everything going on in Africa concerning battle rap, just hit up the archive. But just follow me on Twitter, Alpha Hybrid BR. You would find everything you need. And slide into my DM if you've got any questions. I will be more than happy to provide that to you. Shouts to every league, every battle rap league. Um, Shouts to Battle Rap Africa, um, Word on the Streets Rap League, Lyrical Wars. Shouts to every battle rap league that i may have not mentioned for the sake of um yeah it's <laughs> about you thank you very much tmr the gulag here i come all right now nah, i appreciate you my boy and like i said we will keep in touch anyway all right and like i said yeah. you will be getting to see tke very soon my boy all right most definitely all right my guy i appreciate you i appreciate you all right, salute salute all right, there you have it guys you get me out for hybrid Shout out to the whole of Africa, you know what I mean? Anyone that is from Africa, any battle, hit mine up, you know what I mean? Want to interview, anything, bar breakdown, anything you want to like to promote, league owners, anything, make sure you hit me up, man. I'm here open to work with everybody. Just want to try how to move the culture forward and help the culture, you know what I mean? So, guys, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. You already know what's going down. The Gulag, the 28th of September. Got a fire crazy card. We got Crush V Tex. We got Gemini versus Danny Myers. Whispers versus Z the Dropout. We also got MK versus Rap Rep. And there's six more battles to be announced, guys. All right. So make sure you look out for that. It's going to be a fire card. You ain't going to want to miss it. We don't chase clout. It's strictly business for a bout. Salute. So baby girl, show me what you can do So wine for me, wine for me My girl, take time for me, time for me